So basically, for those that don't know, you can basically change any part of a car to whatever you desire. You want to put a Minolta engine in a Honda Beat, you can do that. Basically, any part given, man. We're continuing on with the madness that we did last time. And uh, we did a slight change. So a crit went uh, through the list and added another 50 entries into the wheel. So now we have about... Let me, let me check. 101 entries onto this uh, randomizer wheel. The last time it was, uh, it was like frequently same parts would occur. So now there might be a bit more variety in here. Without further ado, let's just head straight into it though, man. And the very first thing, it's gonna be a Toyota Sprinter Treno engine. Question is for what vehicle shall we use it? I want to use whatever we have uh, with low amount of horsepower, like somewhere around here. We could take this. We could take the Suzuki wagon. <laughs> Why not, man? That you take the car, then you click load and it'll load all the current parts on it. First thing off is the is the engine. Uh, we can go for this one. And my goal is to at least complete some championships, some cups using the cars that we have made. <laughs> Okay, looking like an Evo, maybe? Ooh, Evo 7. Oh, sorry, Evo 8, my bad. Not a bad start. NA or Turbo? Let's see what it's going to be. Alvar Romeo. <laughs> does that even have... Does that even have a fucking Turbo or su Supercharger? How wonderful. Okay. This will be a real test. How can it even move, man? <laughs> like, it has a decent engine. But the shittiest transmission in history. <laughs> I have no idea how that's gonna work. But, uh, hey, that's the fun part about this mod. You just find out, will these wacky builds even work? So, drivetrain brakes and tires. Let's see. MX-5? Okay, MX-5 then. Are you strong or weak, Red? <laughs> In the middle, I would say. Uh, I don't think I see that here. Maybe it was a typo? Because it has 89 in there. Either way, let's move on. By the way, I think I might... Uh, what I was planning with this mod was... Uh, seriously? The transmissions from the Benz, Paterwagen, and now the brakes from a Ford car. <laughs> This is a speed demon right here, chat. Okay, final part, the tires, man. The Lotus E-Sprit. E-Sprit, okay, I didn't say E-Spirit this time. <laughs> Flashback. Yeah, let's get into the vehicle instantly. We get another E-Spirit. <laughs> so we use the newer E-Spirit to get an older E-Spirit. <laughs> End of flashback. I hope the people in the comments section will forgive me for last time. <laughs> so that'll be our final part, man. Once we have done this, change. Oh, something is not to work. Hmm. Oh my god, the tires. <laughs> I mean, they kind of look good on this thing, don't you agree? <laughs> they might be clipping into the car, but... Uh... The rims kind of suit it. Horsepower, non-existent. Everything else is non-existent with this car. Power and torque, blank. Ah, who needs that, man? We're just gonna use our wings. We're just gonna use use our wings and fly. Well, the power is there. Like, you can see the RPM, you know, going higher and higher. Okay, it actually is moving. It is actually moving, man. Wow. Am I sure that I put the right parts on this thing? <laughs> well, now that it moves, it means we can actually do some competitions. So let's try it out. You are... Oh, come on. That is bullshit. <laughs> actually, actually, I can still keep the tires. The thing is, uh, the game thinks we have those uh, medium tires on. But if I click change again, then now we should have the racing tires. <laughs> one point, okay. It might say one point, but I don't know. I still feel like it'll be a tricky battle. <laughs> call, it, call it a lack of fame, maybe, but I don't know. Oh, oh, wow. Yeah, it's definitely got some power, chat. And it's got grip. 
Would you imagine a wagon like this actually having grip? <laughs> now we have given Suzuki a reason to resurrect the wagon, man. <laughs> We can, we can call this the Suzuki Wagon RS. <laughs> Dude, look at the grip. What is this? This thing is completely weightless at this point. <laughs> Dude, there is another Suzuki Wagon in here. And we... <laughs> I don't know how far we are ahead of it. 207 horsepower, by the way. That's pretty good. Okay, our Suzuki Wagon project, I think I can say is a massive success. <laughs> chat i think i found our new targets now the question is how much more or less will it have with the parts we're gonna add back to our trusty little wheel gillette vertigo race car is that even a thing gillette oh it is actually it was a bit of a buggy buggy startup but that's gonna be our first part <laughs> bmw v12 it's another race car part, bro. <laughs> it is going that route, man. Okay, next up, it's gonna be Shelby Cobra 427. I'm surprised at the Paterwagen. Uh, Paten uh, wait, it's Patentwagen, man. I kept saying Paterwagen for some reason. <laughs> now I'm gonna have more comments saying you mispronounced the pat Patenwagen, man. How dare you? Can't avoid the mispronunciations. Daihatsu DeLorean? A DeLorean? Not sure how that will be, but uh, definitely <laughs> a step up from the previous uh, previous bar we had. Plymouth Cuda. That is interesting. Do we even have that here? A car from the 70s. Does it, does it mean now it won't be able to compete in FF? Honda NSX? Everything we've gotten so far has been pretty good. I don't think we've gotten any parts that are considered bad on this thing. Audi A2. Even good tires as well. Chat, how much horsepower do you reckon this thing will have now? 835 horsepower. <laughs> Actually, we still haven't changed the oil on this thing, so it can go even better than that. 12 seconds later. Okay, now that we changed the oil, how much horsepower does it add? 922 well you know what that means chad power and speed okay <laughs> man the tire screeching is real okay i think it's safe to say this is probably the fastest panda in existence <laughs> i don't even know how many gears this thing has 300 300 kilometers in this thing man i feel like one wrong move and it'll just slide all over the place the power of the belgian engine <laughs> it's still going it's legit not stopping man okay 335 is the max it can go faster than that get ready to drive man Handles okay? Yeah, handling is not that bad. It just takes a while to accelerate, I feel like. Other than that, pretty alright. Just outbreak them. Well, straight lines are gonna be our advantage. They are gonna be our advantage. Oh, no! Well, we do have, uh, I think, Honda and SX brakes, so we're not that bad with braking. <laughs> Dude, the tires are already hot on the rear. Look at that. Hey, good success with the Panda. So, two out of two cars, really good so far. <laughs> okay, our next lovely experiment is gonna be the Peugeot 206, which has about 125 horsepower. Oh? Oh? Okay. Probably a downgrade? Either way, we're going for it. The Stratos, man. Okay, I'll take that. Dude, <laughs> we're so close for the tank as well. Oh? I see turning in there. Audi A4 turning car. Stage 3 as well. Boom. <laughs> Why do I feel like some of these things won't be compatible? Oh no 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 no. They ask you how you are, you just have to say that you're fine when you're not really fine, but you just can't get into it because they would never understand. You know, it says Daihatsu move, but with all the stuff we've put on the car, I doubt it'll move. <laughs> Nissan Skyline GT? Oh, okay. I think this, what, we're, whatever cup we do, it might be a bit competitive now. 
Mazda RX-7 GTX. This might be our first shitbox. Yeah, I'm actually... <laughs> I kind of want some shitboxes, man. Like, we've gotten so many good cars. It, it would be nice to see, <laughs> like, a shitty spec as well. SLR? SLR tires on <laughs> this thing? Oh, boy. <laughs> 120... Two. So we lost only a few horsepowers. And still, we didn't change the oil. I'll do that right now. Oil changed. How much horsepower do we have now? And the car has 136 now. I'm really curious to see. I think it's gonna say maybe 100 points, maybe less. Okay, never mind. Okay, let's just see how it drives for one lap. Dude, look at the tires. <laughs> the width of those tires, man. I mean, it's got grip. I'll give it that. Thing is, what part could we change so it's actually competitive? Like, is it mainly due to the engine? I think just changing the engine to something different should be all right. So yeah, this is the first car that reached 200 points. <laughs> first part that reached that. Hey, back to the drawing board, ladies and gentlemen. Dodge Charger, Dodge Charger 440. Well, it sounds like it'll be faster, but less controllable. <laughs> it was 200 points. Currently it says best A spec points 98. Never mind. Just hear the engine. Oh my god. What have we done? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I think it's safe to say our engine was kind of lacking last time. <laughs> like, everything is just working together. Even the fucking Daihatsu transmission. <laughs> we already have a fucking huge-ass gap from the other racers. 200 kilometers. <laughs> well, it is a muscle car, so, <laughs> so you got that right. It's a Dodge Charger. Honda Life Step Van! <laughs> I feel like this could be a very good contender for an upgrade. <laughs> and it has 31 horsepower. How much can we improve the step van chat? We'll find out in just a moment. Well, Luna, you wanted a Volvo. So here's a Volvo engine for you. The very first part is gonna be a Volvo engine. <sighs> I spoke too soon. Spoke too soon. Uh, oh, 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 please, 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 please. Uh, I mean, Cooper is all right. Okay, can we get a better transmission than the Audi, please? Oh, 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 come on, come on, come on. Oh. <laughs> Damn it! We were so close to the GT40. Next up, we got... The step van got a huge upgrade. <laughs> to us? No, 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 please! How many shit parts are you gonna give me? Are you fucking kidding me, man? <laughs> the only good thing in here is the fucking formula drivetrain. <laughs> what about the tires? Oh, Lupo, I think that's good. I think that should be alright. Oh, boy. Let's see how this thing drives, shit. 127 horsepower. Do we put a wang on it, chat? <laughs> I think the step van needs a little bit more spice to it, you know? Straight type BS. <laughs> Fits it, man. 10 points. So it's not a one point race, it's a 10 point race. Uh, I think we have a little bit of a problem. You know, you know my car is bad when I'm literally a bowling pin for that car. <laughs> Back to the drawing board. <laughs> Isuzu 117 Coupe. This doesn't look any better, but whatever. Nope, 95. Even with a new transmission, though. Weird. Even more drawing board stuff. A Dodge Viper? Still 95, what? So we're just gonna buy the fully custom one and then put the long gear all the way to the end. Five minutes later. If it doesn't, I'm personally gonna yeet it into a garbage bin. There we go. The step van is actually drivable! The step van can actually drive! The brakes are... Yeah. Okay, this is actually interesting. 
Like that fail ADZ is still ahead of us. This is actually looking like a fair competition for once. I like it. Hey Mundi. Hey. Can the snow the How long did it take to break in the 19th century, man? <laughs> What if I use the brake and handbrake? Like, would that even do any difference? Oh, no, 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 <laughs> Okay, we just have to believe in the process of the step van, man. Just believe in the process. What if we gave it a better engine? Just do it! I don't even know how much horsepower that thing has. <laughs> 272. Okay, definitely has horsepower. <laughs> yeah, I, I think it's I think it's all right now. <laughs> I think our step van has. Oh god, I forgot the brakes exist. <laughs> Everything you know is so far decent. The brakes are non-existent. <laughs> I'll be scared. No, 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 not the brakes. The brakes. I think I broke the vacuum cleaner. <laughs> I still have hope in the step van. It can carry us to glory, chat. It can carry us to glory. Just believe in the process. Okay, I forgot. <laughs> Damn it! Well, uh, I mean, I, I think there's still slight chances, you know, slight minuscule chances. If we just had a little bit more time. <laughs> Well, I said believe in the process. I didn't... I, it didn't specify that the process would actually work. Okay, this time I'll break at the 100 meter board. Is that is that fine? <laughs> that is all right. <laughs> Chad, any of you want to buy a step van by any chance? <laughs> it's in pretty decent condition. <laughs> break at 200 and make sure. <laughs> Just it's a precaution of that. Oh, God. Okay, 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 okay. Okay, I did break on time, but I kind of lost control. <laughs> See, this was the process I said you should believe in, man. Now it led us to victory. Dude, this mod has made me drive so many shitboxes. <laughs> like, in normal circumstances, I don't think any of us would ever give a shot for these cars. But with this mod, like, <laughs> it gives you a reason to actually try them out. Thank you everyone for being here, hanging out, check out the Discord, hang out with the community over there. And also the Patreon if you want to directly support my content and future, future projects. As always, and have a nice time and see you tomorrow.